Hey everyone, it's Beauty Butterfly and I'm sure you're saying, girl, your hair is a mess. It's so wow. Yes, it is. I just took out my quick weave and I want to come on and show you all how I twist down my natural hair um, to get the curly look that I had in my grunge look video. Um, I just want to come on and show you all. It's just quick and easy. Um, my hair is freshly washed, well, freshly shampooed and conditioned. Um, this is just my natural hair. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and put my conditioner on it. And then I'll show y'all what I use to twist my hair down. So so if you want to see how I twist down my natural hair to get the curly look that I had in my grunge look video, then just continue to watch. Alright, yeah, so all I did was use some oil. All I used was some olive oil miracle, which is just, um, a mix of oils. I absolutely love this and it smells so good. I'm using my Design Essentials Hydrate Leave-In Conditioner. And I'm just a conditioner type person. Like I like to make sure I have enough things on so to keep my hair my hair healthy. I mean, what I'm doing is obviously working because this is as long as my hair has been all my life. Um, I used to keep a very short haircut, um, but I've been letting it grow out, and I'm two years natural. Um, and so I've been loving the curly look, straight look, the weave, the braids. I love it all. So. All right, next thing I'm going to use, I'm going to use two sprays. I'm going to use my Naked Infusion 365. And then I'm also going to use my Raykin 25 Benefits One United, which is just a 25 benefit leave-in spray. Both of these are leave-in. And this one's really good for detangling, so I recommend this one. I'm just going to spray it all in. All right, now you see it's all on top of my hair. You need to take your fingers and massage it through. All right, and then I'm only using, I'm gonna use some of this to put all over my hair just to make it shiny. So I'm gonna use my Cream Shine by Sations and with and mix with that, like I said, I love my products. Don't judge me, don't do that. Um, so my Cream Shine, then I'm gonna use my L'Oreal Sleek It is for frizz. I've used this before with the twist out that I did and I mean I had no frizz. And the reason why I'm going to go back to my natural hair for a little bit is because where I'm at is raining and raining um, and even with my humidity spray like my hair is frizzing up so bad um, so I need to do something else until the rain dies down and then I'll probably put um, some weave back in or crochet braids. I haven't done those in a while so I may come back on with the video on how to do my crochet braids. So I just took my cream shine. I'm gonna add a pump on my Sleek It by L'Oreal. Absolutely love that. Just because it's not a natural product doesn't mean that you can't use it. You can still use it and it will do good on your hair. You just have to know what works for you. So I'm gonna put this all over. And you can already see it's starting to have such a gloss to it. Alright, so as I twist my hair, I'm going to go in with a little bit of the Sleek It. Even though I've put it all over my hair, I'm going to go in and put just a dab of it as I twist. Um, for my twist, I'm going to use the Beautiful Textures um, Moisture Butter Whipped Curl Cream. Absolutely love this. It smells so good. I like all of their products. And as you can see, I'm almost out. I'm going to make this work until I can get some more. Um, I also have some softy um, styling gel that I'm going to add on just to give it kind of a firmness. Um, and then I'll go back in and grease my scalp. You all, this stuff is amazing. Like, it's almost like a cough drop was put into your hair. It gives you such, such a menthol feeling. Um, so I absolutely love that. Alright, so how I twist is just real quick and simple. I'm, I want some hair in the front, so I just make a part. I'll have my little section. All right, until I come back to this, I'm just gonna twist it down. And I also have a water bottle on hand, just in case I need to moisturize my hair with some water, which I'm sure I will. All right, so now I've got that kind of pulled out the way. I'm gonna do these kind of chunky because I don't feel like sitting here all day. Section in the back. Got 
Got my moisturizing butter, a little bit of sleek it, and my gel. And matter of fact, I'm gonna just go ahead and put it on the entire section. The moisturizing butter. Sleek it. And I'm going to spray a little bit of water. All right, I part it this little piece. Take a little bit of gel. I'm just going to comb it. All right, and so I'm going to do sort of a flat twist. Alright, so that's your first twist. Alright, y'all, so I'm just going to keep going around until my whole back section is done, and then I'll come back and show you all how it looks. Alright, y'all, so after you're done with your first row, this is what it should look like. It should look just like this, just four little twists. Alright, then I take a little rod. I'm going to take two pieces. I'm going to twist the tip. And then twist it up just a tad bit. Take another one. Twist the tip. And then twist it down. And that's what it looks like. Alright y'all, so that's basically how I get my hair twisted down and what it looks like. Um, and then... If you haven't seen my grunge look video, I will also have a picture at the end of this video showing y'all what the hair comes out looking like. Um, I won't take this out until in the morning. Um, it's about six o'clock where I am right now. So I'll be going to bed going to bed in just a little while. So I'm not gonna undo this so you all can see what it looks like. Um, but when I get ready in the morning, I will insert a picture um, onto my Instagram or Facebook or Snapchat. So and my usernames will be at the bottom of this video so you all can go on and see what my hair came out looking like. So yeah, I'm just going to continue up doing the same method. So I'll probably go half here and do all of that back. And then I'm just going to go ahead and just do these downward. Um, so I will come back after everything is done so I can show you all what it looks like. Alright you guys, so I'm up to the front and I'll turn around so you can see the back. So I just did them straight down, put my rods on the end. All right, and then for the front, I've already moisturized it, it's wet. I'm gonna take smaller pieces and instead of flat twisting them down, I'm gonna do some individuals. So it can be just a little bit curlier. like that all right then I just put them together and put them on this one on this rod just like this Take my scarf and then you know before that I just take a little bit of gel 
my style I'm doing. I'm just kind of slip my edges back. And I just kind of lean my head back, take my scarf, and just apply it, make sure my rods are still coming forward. And kind of tuck the other ones back. And just kind of tie it off to the side. Alright y'all, so that just completes this video of how I twist out my hair. Like I said, I will insert a picture from my grunge look so y'all can see how it comes out. And then in the morning when I'm done, I will also be putting a picture of it on my Instagram and my Snapchat and Facebook. Thank you all so much for watching. Don't forget to thumbs this video up and subscribe.